Bad News for Patty Wheeler by Johannes Labusch. Once upon a time, there was a clown named Patty Wheeler. Sadly, he was out of a job. Patty had worked at the circus all his life until the thing with the elephant happened. Patty tried to stick to a schedule and keep his skills fresh, but unfortunately, outside of a circus, there are not too many places where people enjoy clowning. After a month, Patty realized that he might have to find a different line of work. He applied for several jobs. As a bus driver, he felt that his talents were going to waste. Also, some passengers were not too happy about his driving. Patty was a wonderful violinist. He managed to get a job at the symphony orchestra. However, there was a small problem with the way he dressed. Patty also had some disappointing times as a waiter, as a policeman, and as a politician. His mood became worse and worse, not to mention his money situation. Something had to happen. So Patty Wheeler decided to become the most serious person in town. He started working as a news anchor, the least clownish job he could think of. Now Patty had to read serious news all day, out loud. Bad news too. He was surprised how much bad news there was, seriously. After he was done reading the news, they usually cut to the weather woman. Her name was Eusebia Swan, and she traveled all over the country in a small van. Patty thought she was really something. One day, Eusebia Swan was in the middle of her report about a flood in the bamboozle swamps when Patty noticed something. Eusebia, watch out! He, showed, he shouted. It came out of nowhere and it was as high as a building. But Eusebia jumped higher than he had ever seen anybody jump. While she was in the air, the image on the screen froze for a second. Patty was struck by the elegance of her movement. Of, if someone could come and get me, that'd be marvelous, Eusebia said. Then her camera disappeared in the swamp. Patty jumped into his cloud car and drove all the way to the bamboozle swamps. When he got there, Sheriff Buddy Waiter stopped him. No one can go in there now. Much too dangerous. We will send a helicopter, but it could take a while until we could get her out. Patty knew exactly what to do. Stilt! Get it? It was getting dark by the time he reached Eusebia's tree. I'm absolutely done with the weather, Eusebia said. I never should have quit my job as a trapeze artist. Oh, and thank you very much, by the way. Nice is still at work. Two weeks later, when Patty Wheeler and Eusebia Swan opened their sensational two-person show, well, two persons and a monkey, somebody else was reporting it on the news. They had more important things to do.
Oh.